The human brain uses around 300 calories each day just to think, and different mental states affect the amount of energy the brain consumes. Cheryl Engel, a registered dietitian with the Fresno Bariatric Program, explains how the food patients eat can directly affect their brain and mental health. Fatigue and apathy can also uh, reduce their motivation to eat well and to want to cook or even grocery shop. And so when they have those mood disorders, they also have a tendency to lean towards more highly processed foods. Cheryl says nutrients in the food we eat directly affect our brain's health. Researchers out there are showing that um, some of the essential vitamins to brain health are including our B vitamins. Um, they're also including zinc, magnesium, omega-3s, and studies out there are also showing um, some benefits of vitamin C as well. Research suggests that lower levels of certain vitamins in the body can have a negative impact on our mental health. People or patients that have um, depression tend to also have a low vitamin D level. We do know we find it in some fatty fishes like salmon and mackerel, sardines. It's found in beef liver. It can also be found in egg yolks. Another vitamin that can affect our overall mental health B12. B12 is naturally occurring just in animal sources, um, but it can be added or fortified in some grains like breakfast cereals where our B complex, so all the other B vitamins, um, are found in both plant and animal sources. B complex includes all eight of those B vitamins. Our B vitamins can help um, break down those carbohydrate sources, which will help um, fuel both our body and brain. So it's gonna help with our moods, it's gonna help with our physiological stresses, um, as well as some neurological function. Cheryl says that while some patients may need to take certain supplements if they are experiencing low vitamin levels, she recommends creating a nutrient-dense diet first. Nutrition matters. Um, we know that the best way to fuel our bodies and our brains is with whole foods. Um, that's going to be a better way to help minimize the risk of experiencing some of these um, mental health afflictions.